Hello, you beautiful people, and welcome back to Let's Play Uncharted The Lost Legacy. Where we did riddle a little bit in the last episode. And now, have a little bit of a hard time with those bad dudes. I need a new year. Better than no weapon, right? Can you go up? Come on, come on! That was not how I supposed it to be. was quite the fall. You had me worried. Come, it's time for a reunion. He wouldn't give you up, despite my efforts to persuade him. Sam! Jesus. Hey, you made it. Dude. It's all right. He is like a girl. Is that right? How about we get these cuffs off and I'll show you how girls hit. What the hell is she doing here? You said find help, I got help. Yeah. I must admit, you are quite the schemer. First you steal my disc, then you have your expert run me around in circles, huh? <laughs> That's clever. Perhaps there's a little Indian blood in you after all. Let's finish what we started. All right, all right. <coughs> That's chapter eight. Let's finish what we have started. So, Nadine Pass. Don't talk to me. <laughs> I was gonna say, you look good. Was I not clear? What's that smell? Oh, I'm sorry. I haven't exactly had access to running water and soap recently. God. All the people you could have brought with you. <laughs> she saved my ass more than once, you know. You do remember that uh, she also tried to kill Nathan and I many, many times. And to be fair, you two tried to do the same to her. Uh, yeah, but it, that's not the point. The point is that the second we turn our backs, there will be a knife in there. I can hear every word you're saying. I know! I trust her. <laughs> you know what? Fine. I guess I'm just a little bit irked that we are walking away with nothing. But I guess you know what that's like, right? <laughs> <coughs> oh, my. Real classy, thank you. Time and place, children. More that came from. Bike racks after school. Ugh. Just hurry up! So we have gonna solve the riddle. Then not get backstabbed and they're gonna say, well... Uh, I kill ya. And then we fight our way out. Oh, that's ominous. It appears the kings have one final test. Looks like you won't be needing us, though, so we'll just be on Oh, on day. the contrary. Surely you know the story. <laughs> you see, Shiva gave Parashuram the mighty axe that struck Ganesh in the face, bringing Shiva's son, one of the greatest of the gods, to his knees. Another casualty of war. 
Don't. Yeah, seriously, Chloe, he's just gonna go! Uh, he's right. But if you refuse, <coughs> you will watch them die, inch by inch. All right! <laughs> Oh, we don't! Okay, let's see what we got. A riddle. I think flames and the lighting looks beautiful. That can be turned. Wait. Shiva and Parashurama. Can we do anything? Now we can turn the schmuck what he wants. Quiet. Yeah, I'll go on the second. I just wasn't. Come on, go on. You're testing my patience. Don't you worry. Ah, all right. Oh boy. Hmm.
All right, there we are. Fielding. It's going to fall. Right. Ganesh, quite an obstacle you've placed in my path. Hmm. 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 Okay, I need to, I guess, put him somehow in the position to the left, right? Like that. Or does it need to be the center position where he has them all stretched out? Unexpected. Holy shit, she's got balls, huh? I, I don't understand. It's an idiot. That's because you've got it all twisted, my friend. Ganesh allowed himself to be struck by the axe. That makes no sense. <laughs> Not to a selfish prick, no. You <laughs> see, Ganesh could have defeated Parashurama easily. But if he had, that would have made Shiva's axe look weak. Powerless. Ganesh sacrificed himself to preserve his father's honor. See, even she gets it, not a drop of Indian blood in her. Magnificent, isn't it? Oh, what? Nothing to say now? Oh, if you like, I can tell you where to stick it. <laughs> well, my friends, I would love to kill you myself, but we must not anger the gods, for you have brought me a great fortune. Okay, then, what are you doing? I'm going to flood the chamber. I will miss you. Come on, is this really necessary? You know, nothing is ever truly destroyed. Only purified and reborn. Just shoot us and get it over with. Right? As the water fills your lungs, you will have time to reflect on the choices that brought you here. Perhaps in your next lives, you will fare better. Prick. I don't know about you guys, but I got a lot of regrets swimming around in my head right now. Tell me about it. I was really looking forward to kicking your ass again. Hey, you know, I'm not exactly thrilled about drowning next to you, either. Could you give it a rest, guys? I'm trying to concentrate. What are you doing? Okay. The preparation goes a long way. <laughs> but, you guys, that is something we are going to do in the next episode. For now, you know it. I, as usual, really, really thank you for watching. If you guys actually do have enjoyed today's episode, then please give me a little thumbs up and subscribe. And hopefully, and hopefully I see you in the next episode. Until then, I wish you all a wonderful day. Stay frosty. Bye.